in previous video we have seen how to build rest apis and post data to dynamodb using rest apis now let's see how to deploy apis unless you guys deploy apis you won't get rest endpoints those api endpoints are exposed only when we deploy them let's go and see that in previous video we developed this rest api with post method which is integrated with add customer and we tested this piece of code with help of this option here by passing that request body from this text field this option is fine for testing your apis and uh, business logic in lambda functions once development is done we have to deploy this api and get the endpoint clients communicate with rest apis using this endpoint select this good actions and say deploy api let's create a new stage you guys can manage different stages like prod staging and dev let's name this dev a short description about it let's deploy this guy after you deploy this endpoint is exposed pass on this endpoint to client applications using which they can interact with our api gateway expand customer is the resource post is our method let's grab this link let's submit data to this api gateway using postman postman is a client for uh, testing rest endpoints let's create a new one put the url our method is post come to body click raw i'm constructing a json object because rest endpoints always accepts json and send the request this request is sent to api gateway api gateway passes on this information to lambda lambda in turn stores information into dynamodb let's hit this guy batch string looks like syntax issue we are missing ending quotes here let's resend the request we got some issue an error occurred okay one of more parameter values are invalid missing customer id there is a typo right customer id is primary key partition key which is mandatory if you don't send this field dynamodb rejects your request let's resend this okay we got success message saying customer added successfully this is how we deploy rest apis let's cross check this information in dynamodb table let's refresh yeah we got the information this example covers how to deploy rest apis and how to access rest apis outside api gateway dashboard we used postman client to send data to rest apis thank you